Hello everybody, this is Andrew Roboto here, and welcome back to Five Nights at Power Puff Girls 3, where we will be going, trying to go for the good ending in this video, and I actually figured out how to go for the good ending, because I watched a YouTuber's gameplay for how to go for the good ending, get night 6 in the custom night, which, um, I forget what his name is, but I know he, he was able to go for the good ending in one of his videos but yeah anyways so to start off going for the good ending there is a toy in the extras which is blossom that will lead us into a mini game which if you hover your mouse over here sorry if my camera's not showing i'm going to bring it down a little bit it shows a pixelated version of blossom which is um for it'll bring us to the mini game so without further ado let's start going for the good ending I figured out a way how to get those, how to get six cookies. They're hidden somewhere. I don't know where. Oh, there we go. Okay, so the cookies, to, to get more cookies, you have to access this corner right there. And I don't know why they're hidden, but it's stupid. And I always thought those were burgers, but those are actually cookies. They're not burgers. And of course, we got the Super Mario Bros. theme mini game we're playing. So we gotta give all the kids the cookies, the angry kids. Okay, we gotta get. There's more cookies down there, I just remembered. And why is Blossom stuck on the screen? I guess she's levitating, levitating, but why is she stuck there? So we gotta get more cookies over here. I don't know why I was I was fooled in thinking those cookies were actually hamburgers, but they're actually cookies. They're not cook they're not burgers, they're cookies. <laughs> okay. Okay, can I make this gap? There we go. Okay, I barely made it over that gap. The gaps are annoying to get over. I apologize, but I'm adjusting the brightness because I just realized it's a little too bright. Okay, so we got all the kids the cookies. Now we go, we just keep moving. Oh, we got another angry kid. Oh my god. Blossom just killed the child. Ugh, that's... That is so messed up. <laughs> okay. So now we gotta play through Night 5 again in order to get the good ending, which... Which I already know how to do, so... Not gonna even listen to the phone call. Welcome to your final... I wish I could mute it, because I've already heard it. Shift is complete. Let's check the stage to see if everyone's in their place. Great, everything turned out well. We've heard reports of errors with Blossom. Head over to Parts and Service and fix her up. Okay, Parts and Services. Now here comes the stressful part of dealing with Buttercup and Pitch Blackness. And because you can't see her, you have to rely on sound cues. My volume up all the way? Yes, it is. Okay, buttercups, so I gotta stop moving. Now to wait to see when it's safe to move, because all I can do is just listen. Oh, buttercups, so now to wait.
peanut butter cup leaf? I think she did. Okay, now she's back, so I gotta wait again. Still waiting. Okay, I'll take one more step forward and then wait. safe to move or no okay it's not safe to move yet I just I just figured that out because I heard another sound okay so now to wait and then take one or two steps periodically until we know for sure it's safe okay I hear buttercup coming closer Okay. I heard that sound very faintly and I tried to turn up the volume but I couldn't hear it. Okay. God, Buttercup keeps coming and going. Jesus! That sound scared me. I thought that was Buttercup about to kill me. Okay, we finally made it to Blossom. So now what we gotta do is press the red button. Okay. And now she goes. Okay. Hopefully I can get the good ending because I did get all the cookies. I think I got all the cookies. Hope I got all the cookies to the kids because I found I found the hidden ones. Okay, so now we're going back. We don't have to worry about buttercup since she's deactivated. Cause go because making our way to Blossom is a stressful part because you gotta rely on sound cues for buttercup because it's pitch black in the room. Which is really stressful. Okay. And I can't tell when I go back until I hear some kind of noise that startles me. <sighs> okay. Alright, we're making our way back, so that's good. I hope I can get the good ending. Please do not give me that terrible ending. Like you did in my Knife 5 video. Because in my Night 5 video, I wound up getting the terrible end, the bad ending, right after beating it. You passed your shift. All right. Again, since this is the second time I did it. All right, let's see if we get the good ending or whatever you call it. All right, we have gotten the good ending and we have unlocked Night 6. So, okay, so we're in an office, and we have a camera to use. Okay. I assume whoever, oh, I think that's, that's him. Okay, I assume it's him or 
whoever comes to the door is on the camera for the doors. We have to close it. Oh, okay, so we gotta close the right door because him is on that camera. So I assume if him and or and bubbles. Okay, so him left, so we can open the right door. Because we can't use the lights, we have to check the cameras for him. And if he's on one of the cam the door cameras, we have to close it. Okay. So I'm checking the cameras. And then I don't know if we're dealing with bubbles or if it's just him. But we have five cameras to check. Him. Okay, close the right door. There you go. Checking for him. Okay, bubbles is not moving, so the only one we're dealing with is him. Okay, him's at the left door. Gotta close it. Hands at the right, close it. Okay, so night six, we're in an office, and if we see him on either camps four or five, we have to close the corresponding door. Okay, him's on the right door, gotta close it. the right door close it okay did somebody come to the left door because I saw eyes at the left door do I have to be worried about that because I saw some eyes appearing at the left door do I need to be concerned about it him okay Wasted half my power defending myself from him, so hopefully I can make it. That's what I'm worried about. Right door. I'm trying to conserve as much power as possible in between checking for him. Left door, close the left door. Right. Low on power. Jesus, why do you keep switching doors, Ham? Wasting my power, him. I can't keep up with you, and it's only 4 a.m. There's no way I'm gonna beat this night. Okay, we made it to 5 a.m. Him's back. It's probably, there's no way I'm going to beat Night 6. Damn it. Him's at the left door. Great. I'm already screwed now because I just lost power. I'm probably dead no matter what. It's 5, a, it's 5 a.m. There's a slim chance I'm going to beat Night 6. I'm dead no matter what. Thanks a lot.
Thanks a lot, Hen. You just wasted all my power. I gotta figure out a way to conserve the power while dealing with him. Because apparently for night six, we have to deal with him. Okay, so we're only gonna check the door cameras when we hear footsteps. When we hear the footsteps, we're only gonna check cams four and five in order to conserve power. Him, all right. for the footsteps because when him moves moves he's coming closer okay right door close it this time now I gotta listen for his footsteps Back at the right door. Now to wait till he leaves and then check the cameras. Okay, back at the right door. Did him leave or no? He left that time, so we're good. Okay, he's at the right door this time. Not a wait. So he leaves. So I'm trying to conserve the power, and it's not easy. Because him moves quickly. Him comes to the left door, right door more than the left door. Okay, he's at the left door this time. He doesn't come to the left door usually till later in the night. And usually at 4 a.m. he goes to both doors. Knew you were at the right door, him. Okay, back to the left you go. Hope we can beat this because this is really stressful. Okay, he's back to the right. Nope. 
Not coming in. Him stole the right door, so you gotta keep it closed. There we go. We need night six. Right when I was about to run out of power. Ugh, that was really stressful. Just closing the door and going back and forth for him. That's just that was really stressful. Oh, we get a cutscene. What's the cutscene we have? Oh, Blossom. Father. Blossom, it's time for bed. You have school tomorrow. Father. Okay. That was an interesting cutscene. And here's the credits. We've beaten Night 6, so we get the credits again. I don't even know if I can skip it, because it looks like I can't. It, so I gotta close out of the game and then go back in and see what we got. Because I know there's also a custom night. Alright, and as you can see, we have gotten three green stars apparently. We got one for being night five, the, the second one was for getting the good ending, third one was for beating night six. So we got three green stars now. And we have a... Oh, there's a note from Buttercup. It says, thanks for playing. Oh, and Buttercup is a Russian doll. Huh, interesting. Okay, so... We have a custom... We have unlocked the custom night. So I'm going to check it out. See what it looks like. Okay. So for the custom night, we got... The characters we're dealing with are... Blossom, Brick, Buttercup, and Bubbles and him. Okay. Oh, well, we got some challenges we can do here. Okay, so for the challenges, we got Bubbles Party, Tricksters, The Weirdo, <laughs> Buttercup versus The Bud, Angry Blossom, Cupcake Challenge, Blossom's Party, The Nightmare, Five Nuts of Powerpuff Girls. Okay, so Five Nuts of Powerpuff Girls, that is the 520 mode. Interesting, alright. So that's the custom right there. Alright, so we will take on... Uh, let's see, what's the first challenge? I gotta go back, sir. Okay, so we will take on the first challenge, which is Bubbles Party, in the next video. Thank you for watching, everybody. Please hit the like button, also comment and subscribe. I appreciate all the support you have given me. Hit the bell to receive all notifications of upcoming videos on my channel. And I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.